All right, everyone. Um, this morning I just woke up and I felt like you know trying to actually finish a scratch build or something, and I thought about making a Zephyr because I don't know I never flew a wing before and you know I had a whole bunch of micro parts laying around from uh when I my Walkera helicopters and stuff like that. So um, we got some digital servos here from the Walkera, the speed controller, it's 20 amp, and we got a a Tiger one or 1302 motor 5900 kV I don't think this motor is going to be big enough to uh, push this very fast or if at all I don't know I, I haven't tested on it yet because it's snowing outside as you can see um, so just pretty much just built it um, and got done with it but it's cool because uh, it uses the, the Walker uh, gyro out of an M120 so uh, it's got you know like flight stabilization here. I'll show you an example. It was it was pretty cool because all these all these parts are just laying around, so it's not like I had to waste anything. There we go. Try it again. Come on. There we go. Alright. So, as you can see, watch, I lift it up. It's got a little bit of flight stabilization. And it's cool because you can, you know, change the settings on the gyro and make it a little more softer, or more better, or harder. It's pretty cool, though. And then, uh,. I'll show you how much it weighs right now. I think it weighed 99.4 grams. Zeroed. Yeah. 99.3.4, something like that. So. Under 100 grams is pretty cool. Um, give you a little demo of the prop. I don't know if it's going to be strong enough to push it. I mean, if I can feel the power a little bit. I mean, hopefully. But if not, I'm going to try to find a better motor and maybe maybe make it two cell but I kind of like trying to keep it one cell cuz just you know it's small and unique kinda I think I got the CG right I'm not sure obviously I haven't flown it but it seems to be alright when I toss it in the house so yeah that's it um let me know if you like it thanks for watching